Hi guys, it's me Yuni and welcome! It's finally time to play more Resident Evil on the channel. So I've got the third game, the remake, and I'm really excited to play this. I love all the Resident Evil games I've played. I've played 1, 2 and 7 so far. And now it's time to play the third game. I never played the original, so it's completely new to me. I don't know anything about it. The only thing I know is that you play as a Jill in this game. But yeah, I'm really excited. Let's start a new game. I'm gonna go with standard. This pandemic has spread faster than any disease in modern history. Authorities are bracing for more rioting tonight. He was knocked out conscious. Uh, city wide emergency. The CDC has quarantined the lower midwestern Officials regions of the U.S. Say. Commitment, honesty, integrity, these are the core values that create the foundation for Umbrella. It's this foundation that will continue to build a brighter future for all of us. Right, creepy. Oh wow, we can move, wow that's uh, a lot of rain, I don't think I've seen this much rain ever, there's a big storm, so I guess we're playing as a Jill now, but I can't see, is there no mirror here so we can see who we are? so creepy is this <laughs> that's a lot of stickers Let's go in here. The water is running. Oh, here is a mirror. We are jail indeed. Why is the water running? Lot. Oh. What? <laughs> what is going on? Is she infected? Oh! My battery level is low. Oh no. <laughs> I hope I can play a bit longer. But I have a second controller I can change to. What is going on? This has to be a nightmare. I don't believe this is real. She's just dreaming this. Okay, now. 
Yeah. <laughs> Gets worse every night. Oh, there's a dog. So cute. Three more days, then I can kiss this town goodbye. Oh, she's leaving. Okay. Jealous a report. It's already been two months since that mess with Umbrella. Thanks to the suspension, investigations haven't progressed exactly as I'd hoped. Perhaps this written record of what I've found will prove to be my final duty as a STARS officer. I can only hope that it helps lead to the truth. The T-Virus. Those infected with this virus seem to become literal zombies. It appears to be communicable via several different avenues. Outlined below. Bite from an infected in individual, allowing the mixing of bodily fluids. Contact with crows which have eaten infected carrion. Due to the strength of the virus, airborne infection cannot be discounted. It should be noted that those who survived the incident have not yet developed symptoms. It's unclear whether this is because the virus has a long incubation period or because we just happen to be resistant to the infection. We ought to remain vigilant, even after this investigation period ends. As for me, aside from my minor difficulties sleeping, I seem to be in fine shape. Still, I shouldn't get too hopeful. After all, this, this could just be an extended incubation. Umbrella? Question mark. Investigation notes. Pharmaceuticals company, industry leader in market share, focuses on military weapons development while maintaining cover as a pharmaceutical company, also secretly developing bioweapons. T-virus outbreak at Arkley Mountains Research Facility. Predicted dimension incident. Conspiring with Raccoon City leadership. Large donations to Mayor Warren's office effectively controls the city. Alright. That's all we can read here. There, There's no rain now, so I guess, yeah, it was just <laughs> in a nightmare. What's Rainy and stormy. Can we watch TV? That's a really tiny TV. Can we make a phone call? No. <laughs> Her house is such a mess. What is this? <laughs> How can she sleep here? There's barely any space. Too many pills. Hmm. Okay, here we haven't been. Oh, food. It looks yummy, but it's old. <laughs> so it can't taste good anymore. Message from a colleague. Hey, Hotshot. How are you holding up? I still can't believe Iron suspended you. It's such bullshit. He ought to pin a medal on you for making it out of that hellhole back in July. Of course you're going to poke around and ask questions about it. I hope you're not mad at me for keeping my head down. Everything's been happening so fast. Stars was the pride of the force. And the chief disbanded us out of nowhere. I thought for sure I was going to lose my job. Word has it you're planning to leave Raccoon City. I figured you wouldn't take the suspension lying down. Just promise to wash your back. Umbrella won't sit by while you try to dismantle their business. Take care, Jill. Brad Vickers. Stars Alpha Team, now and forever. P.S. Had to slip this message to the pizza guy to avoid detection. Oh, really? <laughs> Enjoy the extra large mega meat supreme. It's on me and the guys. Ah, uh, <laughs> nice. 
Can we leave? No, we can't. Let's see what else we can do here. Here's a door. Oh, that's creepy. Oh my god, and her shadow too. <laughs> oh, some food. Some bread. Alright. What? Did it say raccoon milk? Oh. <laughs> Okay, I guess we have to go inside this room. But it's so dark. Okay, we can turn on the light. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and the water is running. Oh, this is the bathroom we... Yeah. This is where we were in the nightmare. September 28th. Alright. Oh, the phone. Phone. I'm happy to play as a Jill again. Hello? Jill! Are you, are you okay? Brad, is that you? Listen, you gotta get out of there. What are you talking about? I don't have time to explain. You gotta get out of there right now. All right, let me grab my... What is going on? <laughs> what? No. Is this real? What is that? Oh my god. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> Oh my god, is that Mr. X from the second game? Maybe. The thing? <laughs> it looks like it could be him. <laughs> ah! Or what were they called? Tyrants, I think. Oh yeah, I think that's what it is. Tyrant. Gotta get out of here. Oh my god. Okay, this is a big house. I thought we were in a small apartment. Or if are we in someone else's apartment? I'm so confused. <laughs> Alright. Down we go. <gasps> oh no! I wanna I wanna help them. Can I do it? Oh no, I hope they're okay. No. Wow! Just... what? <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, what happened? Oh, nice flowers, but we gotta run. Okay. What? How is he so fast? And how can he know exactly where we are? And why does he want to jail so badly? Oh my god. Just run, just run, just run. What is going on? Oh. There is a store. Oh my god, we can't run anymore. First escape. Brad. Okay, this is Brad. You okay? What was that thing? Tim if I know. But right now it's got a hard on for the only two stars left in town. You and me. I'm not sticking around. Just look around you. The longer we wait, the more screwed we are. 
All right. How did this all happened so fast. I don't know. One fucked up thing always leads to another. It's like Arclay on steroids. I am a Hey! Hey, wait! Down here! Damn it! L3 to run. Okay, we can run. We can run. Alright, we have a weapon. I guess we gotta shoot this guy. Okay, good, we got him. Oh! <laughs> oh no. Can we go inside the bus? Maybe? No, we can't. Climb with this on this. Oh, we can go underneath. Okay. <gasps> oh my god. I think we can just go. Ooh. Can we close the door? Oh, yeah, it closed by itself. <laughs> Perfect. Any food, Sir, water in there? Can't just leave you behind. It's Dario Rosso. And yeah, right. You just want to steal my safe house. Get your own, Missy. Missy? Ammo. Nice. All right. That's a reload. Oh, the dogs. Oh no! <laughs> I had so much trouble with the dogs in the first game. <laughs> Alright. Is he okay in there? He's infected, isn't he? It looks like it. Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> they are everywhere. Shit. No. <gasps> no. Oh my god, it doesn't open properly. <laughs> Safe for a little while at least. But I'm sure there's some more upstairs. Hey, 
What? What? Of course. Sorry. Oh wow, where are we supposed to go? <laughs> Oh no, oh no. He's still alive. He just never dies. We need some really good weapon. Oh my god. How is he still alive from that? That was a big explosion. Oh my god. You can't shoot him. Oh no. What is the tentacle from his hand? <laughs> oh, that's the other guy we played. Who is he? <laughs> hey, easy lady, I got you. Who are you? What are you doing? Carlos. I'm Carlos, okay. On, let's get you someplace safe. I think we're in the clear. I hope so. We've been bringing survivors here. Here where? My guys have converted some subway cars into a shelter. It's safe. I'm fine. Personal space. Okay, I get it. Let's go. <laughs> oh, okay, let's on. go with Carlos. The dipshit to close this. Sorry, we're gonna have to go around. Hey, what do you know about that monster? Nothing. I've never seen anything like it, but it's no zombie. It knows what it wants and won't stop till it gets it. Don't you like that in a man? No thanks. He's all yours. <laughs> Listen, I promise you're in good hands. I'm with the Umbrella Biohazard Countermeasure Service, UBCS for short. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? You guys are the ones who caused all of this. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you talking about? Look, you don't have to trust me, but I'm going to the shelter. You coming? Come on, it's this way. Dino bites. Oh, so many nice posters here. Lobster. Oh wow, I want a lobster. I really want it now. <laughs> Yummy. Traditional Japanese restaurant. Oh, that sounds nice. I love Japanese food. I just get hungry now. <laughs> Comic books. All right, let's go. No one else is here, actually. Oh, there is actually someone. Wow. It's fine, but it's so empty down all. here. Carlos. You didn't even think to ask fine young lady her name? She is an elite operative of RPD, Special Tactics and Rescue Service. Her name is something Valentine. It's Jill. Nice to meet you, Jill. I am UBCS, platoon leader Mikhail Viktor. My team was sent here to rescue civilians. Right. How's that going for you? The city is completely cut off, isolated. Most of the hundred thousand civilians will wind up dead. Uh, correction, undead. My platoon has suffered serious losses. Just keeping them alive is more than I can manage. 
Well, you can thank your corporate overlords for that. Yes. Well, we are doing all we can. If we can get this subway train moving, we can evacuate some survivors. Oh, there is pretty many here. But we need help. My men cannot do this alone. All right. I'm in. But I am on their side, not yours. Oh, hey. It's cool. We all want the same thing. Thank you, Gio. All right, super cop. Here you go. We can use this to stay in contact. I know what a radio is. Okay, first things first. All right. We need to get you geared up. Head up to street level. You'll find supplies there. All right. Can we maybe check a map here? Oh, we can, yeah. Making use of the map. The map screen is useful for more than just your current location and surroundings. It can also show you any points of interest and items you have found but haven't picked up. All right. So up here we should go. This is a locked door. Can we open it? Or was there another way to go up? <laughs> Maybe there's another way, yeah, because this is where we came from. Um, let's see. <laughs> Maybe through the train here. Oh, I'm already lost. Oh, here, here, here we are. <laughs> Alright, this way. Here we can go up, okay. Yeah. New stand. Tabloid front page. The cannibal murders a complete digest. In the grey of the morning on September 25th, a frantic caller telephoned the RPG to report an assault. A man described as disheveled like a vagrant was attacking a passerby north of the Lamps Museum of Art. Responding officers discovered the mutilated corpse of a woman by some dumpsters nearby. Dozens of bite marks covered her body and she had been dismembered, suggesting she had been eaten. The third known incident of its kind to occur in Raccoon City this month. So who done it? Who's been munching on a man's steak? <laughs> we here at the News Comet have a gnawing feeling that the so-called cannibal disease patient Spencer Memorial has been providing free treatment for since August might not be settling for just the cafeteria food. Our reporters have infiltrated Spencer Memorial, asked the tough questions and come back with horror stories that will make your stomach royal. Turn a page for the scoop. Oh, there's some snacks here. Jill, it's me again. You topside yet? Working on it. So what's the plan? The old tanks got me clearing the tracks. You mind getting the subway infrastructure back online? And how do I do that? Let's start by restoring power. I'll navigate you to the substation once you hit the main road. Copy that. Let's do this fast. All right. Oh, wow. So many herbs here. Should I take them with me? I'm not really sure if I have enough space. Maybe I should take a one. One green herb and one um, gunpowder. I hope it's enough. I can take it on the way back again. Oh, what is this? Uh, We need a key to open this. Yeah, okay. We don't have any. Oh! We need to equip the knife here. How do we do it? <laughs> I don't know how to use it! Ah! Uh, oh, like that! Like that! I got it! Oh! Nice! Can we combine them? 
Yeah, yeah, let's do it. Uh, confirm, combine. Yeah. Now just the blue one and we have everything. Oh, what is this? Oh, basic chemistry. Oh, <laughs> the trophy was it a little bit late, like but yeah. Working if I plug in the right whatever it is. We need something yeah, to put there. Here we can save. Oh, this is an item box. I'm just gonna pick up everything then because I can put them away. I will put the gunpowder away, one of them. And there's something we can read. So I'm putting away one of them. I'm gonna put the green herb too. Okay, this is good. Yeah, I don't wanna be full. I always have problem with that and I'm full and I can't pick stuff up. <laughs> UBCS herb field manual. Oh yeah, it just tells um, what I can mix together. Green and red. Or three green ones. Oh, you can do that too. To get the same thing. Alright. And first aid sprays. Yeah. It doesn't say anything about the blue one. But maybe it comes later. But alright, I'm gonna save here. And I will also end this first episode here. So far, I've really enjoyed this game. I'm happy to play Jill again. But yeah, see you in the next episode. Thank you for watching.